Hi, everybody. <laughs> Thank you for joining me today. My name is Pat. I'm out of Southern California. I'm a full-time reseller with Poshmark, Macari, eBay, and Depop. I got to get back into Depop because I haven't really been able to, to do that because I cross-list myself. I do all the work. and It's a, a very time-consuming, but it um, keeps me busy. Um, let's see. I'm going to bring you today a haul from Savers. I haven't been to Savers in so long. I went with my girlfriend, Verge, which I'm going to put her uh, Poshmark closet uh, and her Instagram in my description. Uh, she's been doing eBay for years and years and years, and I'm trying to get her into YouTube because I think she'd do great in YouTube to be able to show all her stuff. So hopefully, you know, she bought a um, fabric and textile box the other day, and I broke down and bought one only because, this is the reason, only because. I want to do um, an unboxing with her to help her out. Um, like I said, I wasn't going to buy any more of the dreaded boxes, but before I decided to do that, I did buy a scarf box, which I'm going to do a collab. But after that, I promise I'm not buying any more. My my uh, team, my, my group, my crew, uh, they let each other, they let us all know what's coming up. You know, if there's going to be a fun box available, designer box, but I'm, going to try and stick to my guns and just, you know, purchase things online and um, go to my local Goodwill and try to check out the thrift, the thrift, the, 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 the bins, the Goodwill bins. <laughs> okay. Um, what was I going to say? Oh, I wanted to show everybody my t-shirt. It's a local artist here in um, my city. We went to, um, like a little festival that they had and I like to try and support small businesses. And he was, had all his t-shirts and stuff. So I purchased it from him. It's uh, Los Dios de los Muertos, I guess that would be it. And uh, yeah, so let's get into my savers haul. Now I'm going to show you what I purchased for my daughter, but she didn't want it. And I don't think it's going to sell right now because of the time it's winter's coming up. But I thought this was really cute because she does live in Hawaii, even though she's living here right now. Uh, it's a cute little um, cropped Hawaiian top. I might take it back. I might keep it. I don't know. It is from Gloria Vanderbilt, which I was surprised. I've never really seen any of her stuff like, um, like this before. It is a size large. Um... It's made of viscose 100%. If anybody is interested in it, let me know and I will sell it to my subscribers. If not, I'm going to take it back and I'm selling this for $7. Okay, so let's get into the, um, the accessories. Well, not really accessories, shoes, and then I have one little intimate. But... Everybody knows how much I love Crocs, right? And I found these really cool Crocs. These Crocs have this, uh, I forgot what it's called, but I have some sandals like that and I really like them. My daughter, I've been trying to find um, Crocs for my daughter because she is stealing my other ones that I have. But I, might, I think I might keep these because these are really comfortable. They have a little bit of a wedge, which is fine. But uh, they are a size eight, my size. How nice of it. How nice of Crocs to have my size. But I thought that they were really neat. Then I found these really cool uh, Free People gold sandals. They're really, I mean, they're in great condition. The bottom, of course, is worn, but the, the footbed is perfect. Uh, the heels are great too. Let's see the heels. And they are a size 36. Is that what it says? I gotta clean the bottom really well. Yeah, they are a size 36. Even though summer's not, you know, winter's coming. Um, California here, I sell everything. I don't care if it's like a bathing suit or something. If I see it's a good brand and it's good. I'm going to purchase it. Now, I get mad, and I think a lot of us get mad. Not mad, but we're, like, disappointed when we get designer boxes and they have these shoes in them. 
but I couldn't pass up shoes that were only like $7. And I do sell them. They do take a while, but I do sell them. And they are Salvador Ferragamo. I thought these were in really good condition, low heel. I wish they were my size. Uh, very good condition. And it has like the little bow there. See the little bow? And it has Ferragamo, Ferragamo on it. These are a size seven and a half. I thought they were really cool. I really like them. So those are my shoes. And then I found this bra, which is so beautiful. And it's by Blush. It's by Blush. And it is a size 36B. I thought it was really pretty. I'm going to wash it in some, um, you know, delicate, uh, on the delicate cycle with some wool light and get it nice and clean. Okay, and now I'm going to show you something that I'm keeping and that my daughter stole from me. <laughs> well, actually, I thought she would like it and she ended up liking it. So um, I'll get to that. But this I bought for myself. Let me explain. It's like a pleather skirt. Um, I haven't tried it on yet. I hopefully it fits me. It's for my Halloween costume. I'm not going to say what my Halloween costume is. I'll take a picture after Halloween and I'll show you. Because uh, we go to uh, my, my nephew, Adam and Elena. They have a big uh, Halloween party every year. And everybody gets dressed up to the tees. And they have like a contest. I mean, it's, it's an amazing party. So I try, I'm trying to get creative. So this is going to be part of my costume. So I'm keeping that. And then I found this other blouse. Uh, it's by PJ Harlow. See that? It's a large. And it's so cute. I love V-neck blouses. And this satin blouse is just absolutely, I mean, perfect for me. It's be good. Here's the back. Just got to take it to the dry cleaning and get it clean once. Or maybe I can wash it machine. But I'm keeping this for myself. And I always tell everybody it's nice to get something for yourself. Because, you know, you're purchasing stuff and you're selling it and getting rid of it. So it would be nice sometimes to keep something for yourself. Don't you think? Okay, so then I got this for my daughter because I thought she would like it. I thought it was really cool. Even though I don't condone what this chick is holding, I uh, I thought that I thought that this was really cute. And this is a sweatshirt, long sleeve cropped. Has a little emblem here. And it has the the chick with coffee and a gun. <laughs> and it is by I don't think it's yeah, it's faded, but I saw it online. It's pretty popular. So she's keeping that. And then I found an Aritzia brand dress. I thought she would look great in this and she looks amazing in it. And it's by Sunday Best. And it is, it is you, you, uh, it is a, under Aritzia brand, I guess. And it's just a knitted, like a razor back, knitted short dress with a lot of stretch to it and she looks so adorable in it so she's keeping that so that was you know you have always got to get something for somebody now what i'm going to put on what i'm going to sell to you guys if you if you're interested and and then later on it's going to go on my um website website my platforms Remember, you get a better deal if you purchase it through here. If not, um, it's always on my platforms. I found these Victoria's Secret pants. I think you wear this with your bathing suit. Or if you want to be crazy and just put underwear on it and go out for the evening. <laughs> but um, it is Victoria's Secret and it is a size medium. Nice, huh? Then I found this dress. I might keep this dress, but I'm not sure. I'm going to clean it up because I see a couple of stains on there that come right off. Um, I love linen, and 
I think linen goes with everything. And especially if you live in California, which right now we're having like 101 temperatures, just nuts. But um, I found this beautiful as a tie. This beautiful dress. It's kind of long, buttons all the way down. It does have pockets. It does have a slit on the sides here. Um, it is by... I've never heard of this brand before. Neo Meli. Neo Meli. Um, it is made in Italy, and I'm pretty sure it's 100% linen. I'm almost positive it is, but let me double check. I just saw the tag. Here it is. The tag says 100% lino, which is linen. I mean, it fits me so well. I don't know. I might keep it. We'll see. But I thought that was a good find. And then I found this fun, like it reminds me of the 60s dress. It's not this from the 60s, but it could pass for it. Oh, it's so cute. Look at this. It's by Donna Morgan. It's a size 12. Donna Morgan, long sleeve, maxi with the tie. Isn't this beautiful? Oh, I fell in love with it. It does have a zipper in the back, which works. I checked it over there at Savers. That's where I, where I went. I don't know if I mentioned that I went to Savers, not Goodwill, on this haul. But isn't this nice? It's very retro. Very retro. And it sells for really good. I mean, it resells for really good. Then I found this, uh, it's called Boy London. My daughter actually, uh, my friend actually saw it. She was going to get it, but she's like, I don't know. I looked up the brand and it's a pretty good brand. And it's just like a little sweatshirt. I, don't, I think it's, I think it's actually men's or boys, boys, probably, you know, teenagers. But I thought it was really neat with the eagle on it. And it says boy everywhere. I thought that was cool. And then I found this golf shirt for women, Callaway. These suckers are so expensive. Um, so it's just a plain white shirt with the flowers and a stripe detail in the back. And it is Callaway, and I thought, I think I could probably sell this. Then I found this beauty, this beauty. It's by, oh wait, I forgot to tell you. It, this um, is a size large. Sorry about that. Size large. It's probably viscose or polyester. Sometimes I forget to tell you guys what it's made of, huh? I always forget. Okay, from now on, I'm going to try and remember. Um, 90, 80, 90, let's see. 94% polyester and then the rest is spandex. Okay. So this is this dress is from N Masson Small. Made in China. But look at this dress. Oh, gorgeous. Look at this beautiful, beautiful dress. And it's a maxi. Isn't this beautiful? I just noticed right now that it is torn. Which is a bummer. I just noticed it. So, I already took the tag off. Darn it. But I'm going to put it back on. I don't know if I can get it fixed. I don't know if it would be worth it to get it fixed. I just noticed it right now. It's torn. 
It's a bummer. It's completely ripped. Yeah. I'm going to have to send it back. That's a bummer. Oh, well. It's okay. I will send it back. I will send it back. I thought I made out, which is a beautiful, but I'm not going to. It's all ripped. Here, let me show you. It's ripped. I bet you I can disclose it, but I don't know if anyone's going to want to pay for something that's ripped. Look at this. See? She must have been big busted. <laughs> so I got to send this one back. That's too bad. Well, maybe it's for a reason. I have to go back over there for some reason. and I'm going to find something great. This is the savers that I found. A Gucci wallet and a Cartier wallet. So you never know. And I found this beautiful, oh, this is so, this is 100% silk. Um, where's the, I don't think it has the tag. It doesn't have the tag on it, which I got to measure. It looks like a small, but it is Chan Lu. Chan Lu. Super expensive, 100% silk. Beautiful, and it has like a razor back. Well, like a little in the back. That's the back. Check this out. Absolutely gorgeous, and it is a maxi. It is very dirty on the bottom, which I'm going to get cleaned. But this dress is completely lined, and it's 100% silk, and it's beautiful. Last but not least, I found this. Did I say the size? Oh, it didn't have a size. Um, St. Germain, Ger, Geraldine. St. Geraldine. It's a small, but check this out. This strawberry knitted romper with pockets. Isn't that cute? My daughter tried it on. It was so cute. She didn't want it, but I thought it was adorable. And I think it's... It's a small, it's a 60% viscose and 40% cotton. Isn't this adorable? It was so different. And that concludes my haul. My savers haul. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. I did. <laughs> I had so much fun going there, but with my knee being kind of still healing, I suffered the next day. I couldn't even walk because I was standing so long. My girlfriend felt really bad, but um, what can you do? I needed to get out. I was getting tired of being, you know, sitting at home. Um, let's see. I haven't done um, a what sold since July. I already have everything that's sold in August. I think it was August. No, I think that was June was the last time I did it because I have everything that I sold in July and August. So I might skip it until I'll start again in September. But I think I'm going to do a couple of, um, see what's sold in my designer boxes from previous. I can let you guys know how I did on there. Uh, other than that, let's see what else is going on in my life. We're going to go to um, Mexico. Well, not really. I don't consider it Mexico, but it is. It's uh, in Sanada, Tijuana. We're going to go down there to go have lobster, believe it or not. Uh, it's the best lobster I've ever had in my life. We're going to go down there for one night. Uh, it's my daughter's birthday. I wish my other daughter could come, but, you know, things happen where she's got to stay home. But we're going to go down there for the night and come back and have a little uh, celebration for her when we get back also. So that's what's on my agenda. But um, I'm hoping to do more videos. I was doing two videos a week, but got to be expensive because <laughs> I have to go buy stuff and do it. I do have one more jewelry box that I need to record, which I will probably do that next. But other than that, uh, thank you for joining me. I'm at three, 397 subscribers. I need three more to do my California giveaway box. So I'm waiting patiently, hopefully... Uh, when this video airs, it'll already be done and I'll be able to do my giveaway. Uh, but other than that, I want to thank everybody for joining me. I appreciate it so much from the bottom of my heart. 
I, I look forward to comments and likes from everyone. And uh, that's all for today. I thank you very much and have a wonderful, wonderful day or evening or night or evening and night is the same. Have a wonderful time in life. <laughs> thank you so much. Bye-bye, everybody.